and Jets. Yeah. AFC East matchup. They're playing at one o'clock. We got the Bills just coming off of a win against the Packers, and the Jets coming off of a of tough loss against the Patriots. Another huge spread here. Bills minus thirteen. Going to New York, MetLife Stadium. And after what I saw from the Jets offense last game, facing off against the Bills defense, it's not going to be pretty for them. And the Bills, over the last few years, kind of own the Jets. Last game, last year, I believe they shut them out, if I'm not mistaken. So another game where it's just going to be the Bills doing what they do, which is just to kind of dominate teams. Yeah, oddly enough, I think this game can be closer than Packers Bills, um, just because it's in New York. Um, well, it's in Rutherford, East Rutherford, New Jersey. But I think the Jets defense is pretty good, and I think they're gonna be able to slow the Bills down. I don't think it's gonna be a good game. Zach Wilson gonna make a lot of dumb throws, and the Bills are too good for the Jets to be able to hang around, hang around, and get those one possession wins. And it's like we're gonna start to see these teams like the Giants, the Jets. Once they, they've been hanging around against teams that are to their level that don't have explosive offenses and holding them down, but it's like against a team like the Bills, it's like, no, no, no. Two plays could ignite a 30-0 to run unanswered. So it's like you just don't have the weapons to compete and you're overmatched. Yeah. But this game could also be a trap, though. So it's like would I be surprised if the Jets some way found a way to upset them? Ish. At least cover. I mean, thir- you're talking about two touchdowns. Yeah. Like, can I see the Jets losing, like, the same score like the Packers, 27 to 17? Yeah, sure. Absolutely. So this Sauce is Gardner on Stephon Diggs. That'll be fun to watch. This is a great test for Sauce Gardner. I mean, facing off against one of the league's best wide receivers. Yeah, I kind of want to see what Josh Allen will do too if they just completely take away Stephon Diggs. Like, if Sauce Gardner says, "No, you're mine." and you're not going to touch the ball, and he doesn't, what's the Bills' offense going to look like? I probably will sound stupid for saying this, but I'm curious. It'll probably be the Gabe Davis show at that point. Yeah, but it's a good test for the Bills. Yeah, I mean, honestly, I'm here for that. Sauce Gardner and Stefan Diggs, they seem to be like the the key matchups in this game. 